Hello everyone, welcome to Knowledge Circle. In this video, we will see the use of split method and the use of string tokenizer class. We can also extract the word using substring method. I have already made a video on that. But in this video, we will see the use of split method and string tokenizer class. So let's begin this tutorial and uh, uh, we'll create a class here with the name SS and we will see the use of split method how we use split method to separate the words from a string okay so here what i do i create a program and where we take input from user we will take a string as an input from user so the very first line of the program is import java.util.scanner then we create a class here with the name ss and then we begin the scope of the class after starting the class we uh, create the main function and after writing the main function we begin the scope of the main function then we create the object of scanner class to take input from user and after that uh, we will provide a message to the user to enter a string so using the println method of print stream class we create a message here enter a string okay after that we need to store this string into a variable so we will use a string variable or with the name s and with the help of next line method of scanner class we receive the input as we know that words are separated by space so we will use here split method and in split method we will pass space as an argument so the word will be words will be separated and the return type of split method is array so here we will create a string array with the name a and all the words are separated and they will be stored in the a which is an array now we will run the for loop to extract and display the elements of the array so the loop runs from 0 to the lesser than the length and now to display it we use println method and here we write ai so all the words which are separated will be stored in array and they will be displayed now let's go for the compilation class compile no syntax error let's run the program here we will enter a string i write here honesty is the best policy so see the words are separated by space and they are stored in the array honesty is the best policy it is shown in a different line now what we are going to see here we will see the use of string tokenizer class since string tokenizer class is in the util package that's why we have written the first line we have removed the scanner we have imported the entire util package what we need to uh, make changes here will create an object of string tokenizer class and we will pass the string whose word is to be extracted in the constructor of string tokenizer class so we want to extract the words of s so we will pass here s now there is a method of uh, string tokenizer class has more tokens with the help of this method this method tells how many tokens are there in the string so we will put this condition in while loop that st dot has more tokens so this loop runs till all the tokens are found and here we use next token method of string tokenizer class to extract the tokens st is the object and next token is the method now let's go for the compilation process file saved no syntax error now let's run the program void main enter a string so let's enter a string here india is a vast nation okay and then now we will press enter and what we find that the words are separated and displayed now we are going to see the another use of a string token as a class and by providing some more arguments the first argument is the string itself and the second argument are the separators so second argument is in the form of string here we provide a space then it may be separated through dot and then we can have question mark also we can have exclamation sign so if we find these symbols then also the word should be extracted now what we need to do we have just uh, to recompile the program and we have to re-execute and now we will provide a string along with these separators so here I am writing how are you and then I'm putting question mark now you see the tokens are separated properly how are you now let's go and uh, re-execute and enter a string again 
and let's write here a sentence with exclamation sign what a night the day is and then exclamation sign okay and now when we press enter what we find that the words are separated so this is the use of string tokenizer class